Hey everyone, welcome back to um, some pack openings on Gamer Treasures. Um, I got a whole bunch of Ikoria Collector's Edition. I opened one of the packs already, and I was going to open up some more, but I just want to show you what I got in the first pack off camera. The Pork You Parrot. Got an island. A Mana Molten Echoes. A Full Art Non-Foil Cheville Bane of Monsters, a Foil Triome. Let's separate these two. Got a Sea Dasher Octopus. A uh, Gigan Cyberclaw Terror Companion. When Garuda enters the battlefield, each player puts the top four cards in the library into their graveyard, put a creature card with an even converted mana cost from among those onto the battlefield. And then the badass card I got was a Foil Full Art Vivian. Um, so yeah, but anyways, over here where I'm going to look, there's more packs, um, and we're just going to open some more. They're in these, uh, blisters. They were out of like a wholesale buy out of them or whatever. And I got my hands on a few. I guess we'll just do three first of all. Let's see what else we can get here. <clears throat> we got another beast token. Jungle Hollow, a Dolphin, Checkpoint Officer, Facet Reader. Oh, did I not have any uncommons in the first pack? I did, but I didn't separate them. Okay. Now, after I sort these correctly, Crystal, Keen Sight Mentor, another island, a Paco Arcane Retriever, that's pretty decent, a, a Gyruda, Doom of Depths, that's what com, um, goes with Gigan, a Foil Slither Wisp, which I'll just go to the regular Foil Wearers, a Great Horn, Insatiable Hemophage, an Everquill Phoenix. King Caesar and a foil gem razor. Four for a uh, four four reach trample whenever this creature mutates, destroy target artifact or enchantment and opponent controls, or you can mutate for three. And this is the box topper version, so this is gonna go in a sleeve here. <coughs> oh, we got a cat token in this one. Pretty crazy looking. Prickly marmot. Pangolin, Rescuer, Titanith Rex, Neitherborn Altar, um, Dranith Magistrate, Obosh the Prey Piercer, Companion with something. If a source you control with an odd converted mana cost would deal damage to a permanent, it deals double that damage instead. And he's an odd, so. It's kind of cool. Pouncing Sky Shark. Lord Dracus. Oh, we got a Triome. Full Art Triome. Oh, we got a Godzilla Doom Inevitable. And then we got a full uh, foil uh, Majestic Orcorn. Huh. Yeah, we're going to have to resort these later, maybe. Anyways, hopefully this glare isn't super bad. Uh, I didn't put up the beast token. Didn't put up the special lighting. No time, no time. Draw four cards, that's not bad. Ooh, I seen something kinda good. Vitality Hunter. Uh, fr fr Frondland Feldar. And then we got a foil Luca Copper Coat, which I know is good. A Volcapete. Cloud Piercer, a Savai Triome, 
a Dorette Perfect Pet, and then we got a Regal Leosaur. So we're going to put the full art in a sleeve because it's foil, and the Luca in a sleeve because it's foil. Um, and we're going to open up some more. Continuing on. Okay. We got a dino, one one haste dino. Survivor's Bond. Glimmer Bell, I can't believe they reprinted that. Got the Skull Prophet, that's a cool looking card. Swamp. Brawlin' Sky Shark, another Sheffield Bane of Monsters, a foil Labyrinth, 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 Raptor, Pork Gig, whatever, Majestic Oricorn, another Everquill Phoenix, oh look it's a baby Godzilla, and then we got a Lord Dracus, and I don't think the baby Godzilla's worth a whole lot, because it's an uncommon. But we got a cat token, so with some unlikely aids. Start got a crystal. Oh, I've seen a full art. Uh, cryptic trilobite. Some of the cards' names are pretty cool. Song of Creation. Foil Mythos of Snapdax. Strix. Drinktel Heron. Raugren Triome. A Baby Godzilla. And then a migratory great horn. Put the full art card in a sleeve. We need to get some some really good hot fire cat bird. Glimmer bells back. Sanctuary lockdown. Savai thunder. Swamp. Eon Fro Elon frolicker. If you cast it, target opponent takes an extra turn after this one. Until your next turn, you and playing Watcher, you control game protection from that player. That's kind of weird. Oh, it's Alurus of the Dream Den. He's pretty good. Oh, we got the Quartz Wood Crasher. Full Art Foil. Boneyard Lurker. Cavern Whisperer. We got a Dirge Bat Boy. Godzilla Primeval Champion. And then we got a Foil Chittering Harvester. Okay, still no crazy mythic. What a, oh, it's a shark token. That's sweet looking. Boot nipper. We got General's Enforcer. That's a cool card. You pray a mountain. Glade Muse. Whenever a player casts a spell, if it's not their turn, they draw a card. Genesis Ultimatum. The foil regular guy, Ruta. Migratory Great Horn. Majestic Arcorn. Another Triome. Oh, and a foil Godzilla Doom Inevitable. And a Parcel Beast. Okay. So we got a Godzilla. <clears throat> Catbird. Crater, Archelijo Island, Daring Fiend, Bonder, Mythos of Illumina, a Foil Savaya Triome, Glowstone Recluse, Cavern Whisper, a non-foil Vivian Mythic, 
a Death Corona, and a Foil Sea Dasher Octopus. I'll put this one since it's a Mythic. I don't know where that'll go. Right there, I guess. Well, I don't know if I should open any more. How many was that? That was like five. Four more. Four more. Oh, we got a kitty. Spring draw trap migration path. Keensight Mentor, a Swamp, Cleesey and the Plague, Vigilance Haste 2-2 two, two for 3, gets plus 1, plus 1 for each experience counter you have. You can tap it to do damage to a creature you don't control. When that creature dies this turn, you get an experience counter. Weird. Another Genesis Ultimatum. We got a Sea Dasher Octopus. See, this was a full art in the last pack, and it's a regular one in this pack. Cloud Piercer, Volcapete, Dirge Bat. All the foil death corona full art and a glowstone recluse. I don't know. I think you could don't I don't even know if you can sell these on eBay. I think they made you take them down. Guess I can go up there with the regular rares. That'd be nine, twelve, yeah, it's like twelve packs, I think. I was just seeing I was trying to open up a cold one of like a box. Here, crystal. Got a cool island here. Frontier Warmonger. Lutri the Spell Chaser. Companion. Karuga the Massa. The Macro Sage. Macro Sage. Satial Bohemophage. Volcapi. Oh, the Brokos Apex of Forever. And a Godzilla. And the Archie of Full Gore. I don't know what's what in the set. Would we do get another shark token though, which is amazing. Okay, we got the flourishing fox is a cool card. Got more trilobite. Hunted nightmare. When it enters the battlefield, target opponent puts a death touch counter on a creature they control. Mythos of Illumina. Pouncing Sky Shark. Lord Dracus. See dash or octopus. We got a Rodan and then a foil Dreamtail here on. I need to get these guys in um, this Rodan. I need to get them in foil, not in non-foil. That's some Garbo. Okay, last pack of the evening. That's been kind of a quiet one. Let's see what we got after this beast token. Tranquil Cove looked cool. Fertilis, not a bad card to open. Neither is Primal End, but the Lord leave the Stampede. Mountain. Twinning Staff. Crystalline Giant. We got a Foiled Genesis Ultimatum. Mystic Aracorn. Migratory Greatheart. Um, we got a Foil Caesar and an Insatiable Hemophage. So, I don't know if this is good or bad. I think these triomes, even in the non foils, are worth just a little bit, maybe. Um, I don't know. I pulled quite a few of them, though. 12 packs, I pulled one, two, three, four, five, five of them. Non foil. A couple mythics in here. I don't know if this is good or bad for 12 packs. It seems okay. But anyways, uh, let me know what you think. Drop a comment below. Um, I hope you guys have a great rest of the week, and thanks for watching.